hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be doing part two of customizing a frontal and i'm going to show you guys the plucking process don't forget to subscribe and let's get right into the video okay guys so after you finish the bleaching and toning process of the knots you're going to start the plucking process you want to make sure that you pluck in sections so after you make your sections you're going to section off the front piece of the hair which will be considered the baby hairs and for me i take my water bottle and i spray the hair because i am able to see better when the hair is wet and then i start plucking behind the baby hairs that i pulled out and when you pluck you want to make sure that you pluck you want to make sure that you keep moving when you pluck. You want to make sure that you don't stay in one area. And as you can see, I'm moving just up and down along the hairline. Now mind you, it may seem like I'm going really fast or being really rough, but I'm not. The video is sped up. So when you're doing this, just make sure that you're going slow, take your time so that you don't rip or tear the lace because you don't want any ball spots. Period. When I feel like I've did a decent amount of plucking, I will go and take my comb and part back another section and then I'll start plucking that section as well and I'll do that about two or three times Right here, I slowed it down for you so you can see how I pluck. I pluck from the root and I just keep moving and I don't pluck in one spot. I keep moving so you don't create any bald spots. When I feel like I have plucked enough, I will push all the hair back and I will pluck the front hairline just so the frontal looks a little bit more natural. And when you finish customizing your front suit, it should look like this. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.